Other Bits of an Artist Life. This is Sandy and Grady, husband slash manager, behind the scenes man. Does all the work behind the scenes and encouraging. I cannot believe we are finally filming this video where we get to announce to you our first online class. And I say we, and I invited Grady because we have been working hard on this for months. Well, I feel like it's been, it's a, <laughs> I've been about to suck the life out of me. So we are getting to announce the first online class with many more to come, hopefully in the future, which we'll talk a little about that in a minute. I looked this morning and we filmed, or I filmed back in March, and we thought, I think right after that we'd be launching this, but there have been so many hiccups. <laughs> I mean, just one thing after another, and I'll spare you all the boring details. It's been six months coming. Probably started in January. Yeah, I'm sure I even started thinking about it and design kind of concept like back in December. So what, six, seven months now? We've been working on this and we finally get to bring it to you. It's the launch day. It's exciting. Yeah. Great job. Yes, okay. What I want to do first is share with you the kind of what promo commercial for the class. I'm gonna put the links below to everything. You can get to it from here, you can get to it from Instagram, my website, and that will take you to a page where it will not only have the video that I'm about to show you, but also list out what each video that's in the class will be about. It's jam-packed, it's almost two hours long, and it is all about my journey with acrylics and sharing with you everything that I've learned and that I know and everything to help you get in quickly and clean up quickly and all of that. So let's play that video. And then if you're interested, when we come back, Grady and I are gonna share a little about kind of like our plans for the future, some of the next classes that are coming up and just things we've been dreaming about. So let's jump into the promo commercial. Is there a better word for that? Probably not. Probably not. Info, oh no, it's infomercial. Well, no, it's not, but it is the info of the class. It's a peek into the class. A peek into the class. Without further ado, launch it. <laughs> okay, did I push record? Okay, I did. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to this class course a video. I don't know at this point what I'm going to be calling it, but basically it's a place where everything that I've learned and figured out on my journey with acrylics is all in one place. I want to share with you in this space all that I've learned. I have picked up so many tips. I have developed so many processes and I just want to share it. Let's first have a little chat about the different forms that acrylic paint can come in because there's a lot and it can feel very overwhelming. All right now almost all the animals are in here. Hey, I almost forgot about my acrylic inks. These need to be in this video. So let me tell you about them. I think sometimes where the most important place to gesso paper is... Where are you? I know you're here. Now let's do brushes. Let's get into brushes. I get very excited about brushes and I think you may be surprised at the a range of brushes you can use for acrylics. Now let's move into palettes and how to store your paints. I've gone through a process with my palettes and I'm gonna share all of them and where I have ended up is the easiest process for me of getting into painting and cleaning up. That's a big deal for me. I want to just be able to paint when I have a few minutes. I thought I would do a little test for you guys because I have a feeling you're gonna wanna know like how long can I keep the lid off these? Well, 
Okay, let's talk about mediums. Yes, let's talk about them. This is an area that can feel there's so many mediums and just stuff out there for acrylics. So there's contamination. I've been contaminating for a long time. That sounds like a biohazard or something, but I have. Just call me contamination lady. Okay, we better move on before I start singing more. Let's move on to our next topic or subject. Let's talk about the different brands of paint that I personally enjoy. I wanna to try to give you a visual of perfect paint and too thin of paint. Okay, let's talk about some other paint stuff. You add the friend to come in and you can just add a kiss of it to neutralize it. That's gesso. No. Take two. That's canvas. Let's talk about paper because I love painting on paper. Let's get started and jump into it. I hope you enjoy it. So that gives you a little peek into the class. It is just jam-packed with info. And again, it is just, it's like all the stuff. Mediums, my palettes, all the palettes I've used over the years. So maybe one will interest you more than another, but also share where I've landed, which is really quick and really easy to get, you know, started and clean up. I share all my favorite color mixes. I mean, it's just, it's really loaded. I mean, I almost picked up a paintbrush. You did? It's so informative. No. <laughs> really? It's really good, y'all. I've shared it with friends that have watched it and I've just been getting great feedback. So we are excited to share it with y'all. We also did a really soft launch, which did really good. And yeah. we've been hearing great feedback. So we really hope you enjoy it. Um, we've put a lot of work into it. I just wanted to share everything I could about this because here's our thoughts with this class. Were you about to say something? No, okay. This class is going to be $65. It is going to be cheaper than future videos because we wanted it to be something that could be more affordable than the future videos, but also because future videos, I can't share all this information in each video. So it needed to be in one condensed, is it condensed or concise? Sure. Place. That way in future videos, I can kind of just jump into whatever the subject is. My bra strap is falling. I gotta get that real quick. That's okay. <laughs> okay, your bra strap. Yeah, because it'll be applicable. If someone jumps into a future class yeah. and they want to know more about paint pots or color mixes. They can go get that other video yeah. and at a, at a cheaper price. We yeah. did want it to... It's really to, accessible. Yeah, to be accessible. In the future, it's going to be more of my actual process and kind of the, the innards. Then you really get up into her head somehow. Good luck. Okay, let's share some of our thoughts for future classes. So this year slash beginning of next year, our plans are, I do want to do another class that's going to be based on the workshop that I did on still lifes, which was called Tackling Issue Areas. It's not gonna be like Zoom recorded. It's gonna be a real class that's formatted for more of a class kind of thing. So we're gonna do the still life one. We're gonna do a landscape one, probably in the fall or winter, when it feels a little better to get outside. And I also wanna do one that's probably gonna be titled something like play, which we're going to just get crazy. Crazy dirty. I'm still like formulating all of that. It'd be fun if I make you do it first. It'd be fun, I'll film. Oh, okay, he'll film. And then for the future, which is crack, I'm still getting cracked up when I was thinking about recording this and telling you guys about like our long-term plans. I still get cracked up that this is our long-term plans because I actually don't even like to travel. So our plans are, do you want to tell? A little no, bit? you tell oh, it. Okay. It kind of sort of birthed within you, which is even yeah, more bizarre. It is bizarre. I think it started with the fact that, well, first off, let me tell you, I don't, I'm not a traveler. I'm very much a homebody. Grady's a traveler. He would travel all the time. I just like three days into a vacation, I'm usually complaining because I'm ready to go home. <laughs> um, I just love being home. I love it. I uh, love being Very here. True. 
But a friend of mine said, I wonder if maybe a longer trip, like a month long, if you would enjoy that better. And so I think that's where I started thinking, maybe, maybe we could do that. And I was thinking about how it could be really interesting to film packing for that month long trip and, and then filming all on the trip of taking notes and all of our goofy stuff. Uh, so it would be kind of entertaining also. And then bringing all those notes back home and doing finished paintings. Like that would be the video, the class, kind of this journey of that. And maybe if we get into that, that it would be like an announcement. We would announce where we're actually going this year or if we do two trips a year. I don't know. Maybe we'll get really like into it. But I do find it interesting because I don't really like traveling at all. So we'll see. Or well, maybe drop an anchor for a longer time will feel more settling. Yeah, that's what we're hoping. But we, we think that could be really fun. And I want the classes to be, yes, informative, but also entertaining, like the YouTube videos, videos are. Casual and still all the goofiness, but you will get more behind the scenes. My YouTube videos, I'm able to just pick up the camera and I don't have to do a lot of forethought. With these classes, there's much, much, much more forethought and planning. I mean, I had so many pages of notes for just this class that it was... It was a notebook. <laughs> had to buy a, pad of, a stack of pads. Also color-coded them. <laughs> just fun to help, helped make it organized. So that's why we're not going to be doing a bunch of these. There's going to be a couple... One or maybe, two a year, maybe. Yeah, one to three a year because there is so much that I put into a class like this. And you love YouTube, so you're going to keep I do, doing yeah. YouTube. We are going to continue doing YouTube. It's a place where I'm able to just pick the camera up and be whatever and just show you what's going on in those places. I'm glad you mentioned that because I didn't want people to think that yeah. we're leaving YouTube. Love YouTube. Yeah. Love you um, speaking of notes, let me see if I have... Um, That's it for now. Yeah, I think that is it for now. I feel like it's there exciting. was something else. Yeah, go team! It's a lot of fun. Sandy worked hard. I think you'll find it very profitable. I hope so. I think so. Those of you that have followed me for a long time on YouTube, you know that I'm very open and I hear a lot from you guys that I am very generous with what I share. And so you get even more of that. I'm going to just tell you, in one of my class videos, this necklace was doing this the entire time. It was oh, driving me crazy. What if it was going on now again? I hope not. What was I saying? Oh y'all. So the the classes that we'll be offering will be redonkulous informativeness. Informative and entertaining. Hopefully you'll get more of what you already enjoy here. So yeah. thanks babe for yeah. all your help. Enjoyed it. Yeah, great job. I literally okay, do you know I feel like I need to have like a what is that thing like at the end of a movie? They run the credits. I feel like I need to have credits like coming down like right here she i could have not have done this without if you've helped me you know who you are i mean so many people i felt like god provided so much help i literally could not have done this without the help i did not know what i was getting into with this yeah i did not know we're super grateful way above my pay grade to set up a platform like this for classes way above it's simple. It's straightforward. I think you'll find it easy to navigate. So I think it was worth the time, energy, and effort. Yeah, I do too. Go I feel straight. very, very, very proud of it. I feel like I've birthed a beast. I feel very proud of it. I felt I, before we did our soft launch, I got a little nervous, like, oh no. And then the compliments just started pouring in. The feedback of people just feeling like, wow, this was not only informative, but made me want to go paint. And... Are there six videos? I think so. Six videos for this class. I mean, I go over varnishing. You already know because you've already watched the video of what all I go over. But if you go to that page that I'm going to have linked below, it will have that video again and also detailed listing out. And then also some Q&A stuff. True. I feel like we've given you enough information to know what you're getting for for $65. Okay. Have fun, y'all. Yeah, we fun. did. Yeah. I mean, I'm ready for a rest. Anyway. <laughs> uh, we need a vacation. I need a vacation for sure. Grady was like, I think you need to take a break before you start doing the next one, which yep. I am. 
I'm gonna take a little rest and then I'll start working on the next one. Should Go be team! Fun. Should be fun. Hope that wasn't too loud. Thank you if you've helped me. Oh, I couldn't have done it without you. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you guys for purchasing. Those are you guys that are gonna purchase. Okay. That's Anything it. else? The end. That's it. The end. Oh, I like that. Should we like sign off? Yay! I'll see you back here next week. Bye without bye. me. Oh yes, without me. Okay. Bye. We didn't even have an animal come in here. We had one. One cat, board. but he's quiet. We should have put him on camera. I know. He's the best. Can you believe? So you didn't even know he was here. He's so quiet. He's not like those other ones that are so annoying. That's how you know Cooper's not doing good either. Though we didn't even come in for the filming, <laughs> and we're both in here. Anytime we're even. Maybe watching, we didn't laugh enough. I don't know. Well, that's true. We may not have laughed much, but even when we're watching the videos before the we the preview. He's in here making all kinds of noise. It's so hard to watch. And here comes a helicopter, so maybe we better go now. Okay, yeah, I'll see you back here next week. Bye, guys.